Welcome everyone. I'm Chris Kaplis. I'm the uh, director of the SCX uh, MicroMasters program in supply chain management. I'm here with Jim Rice, um, who is the uh, deputy director of CTL here and runs all of our executive education as well as our partners program. And we're here to talk to you about the new offering that we have specifically only for the SCX students, and that's the boot camp. And so this is the boot camp for supply chain management that, as I said, is only open for those who've completed at least three of the SAX courses. And we thought we'd uh, explain why we're doing this. So the first is you've all done these online courses and you've come to realize by now, I'm sure, that some things you can learn online and some things are best taught face to face. And that's what we want to cover in this boot camp. From August 22nd to August 25th, it's a very intensive four days where you get to do a lot of those things you can't just do online. Um, the second thing is that we found that some students, um, they finish the MicroMasters, but they can't come uh, and quit their job for five months to come get a master's degree. I'm a big believer in coming for that full intensive time period, whether it's 10 months, five months, or two years, but that's not feasible for some people in their current state of their life. So this is another offering. It's another piece of the portfolio for the education. Um, the third is some of the offerings we offer for executive ed aren't quite suited for the SCX students, they're either a little too general and they don't leverage the kind of learning that you've already taken and that you've acquired. So we really kind of focus it on, on those kind of things and that's why we're offering this. And the final reason is because we can scale. Um, a one week offering is something we're gonna do as a pilot because we're testing it, we haven't done this before. If it works, then I can see replicating this multiple times in terms of frequency, but also location. We have a lot of learners in uh, Latin America who would probably be um, more willing to come to Bogota for a lesson. In Southeast Asia, come to Kuala Lumpur. Or in Europe, come to Zaragoza or Luxembourg. So we're playing with this. We're going to see how it works the first time through. And uh, it's an experiment, like everything else we're doing in this uh, program. And so we don't quite know how it's going to turn out, but you're in here for the journey. And so I asked Jim to talk a little bit about exec ed and what he's done in the past and what they couldn't expect. Yeah, thanks, Chris. Uh, let me just address one comment you just made. Uh, we don't know how it's going to turn out. Well, I think that based on all the exec ed we've done in the past, we have a pretty good uh, feeling for how things are going to go. You know, we've done short programs, long programs, custom programs, open enrollment, and most recently, almost all of our programs are what we call blended meaning that there's an online component to it. One thing that is, is in common that we have across all these is that when we, when we bring people together in person, there's the, the chance for that transformative experience. And you'll find that as an online learner, your experience is going to be very different. Your experience is going to be where you're going to share an idea and it's going to get challenged. You're also going to have to think on your feet. So whatever ideas you have coming in to, say, a case discussion, it's going to get challenged, and then real time, you're going to have to say, oh, wait a second, I have new information. What does that make me think now? Right, so to, to tie on to that, everything we do online is what's known as asymmetric. You can do it at any time. Because you're across the world, we can't have everyone online or in the same room at the same time. What Jim's alluding to, when we do a case study, like when we did it online, you all commented by yourself, there was very little interaction back and forth. I can guarantee you in a classroom with everyone sitting around, there's a ton of interaction and you do get challenged. And that's where the real learning takes place. That's why we're, we're going to stock the, uh, this uh, boot camp with a lot of case studies where there's a yep. lot of discussion, debate. There's not always a clear answer because that's another problem, strength and a weakness with the online. There's always a correct answer. For cases, it gets a little fuzzy. Yeah, it, it, you'll, your, your ability to think critically is going to be challenged at this. And just as Chris mentioned, it's going to be very intensive. There's going to be lots of interactive activities. In fact, that's one of the big distinctions between the online, uh, I mean, this boot camp and our open enrollment programs. This one is almost all interactive. Ca you know, two cases a day, interactive exercises, and then we have research briefings from faculty members across MIT. So it's going to be really exciting, I think. So it's going to be very intensive for those four days. We're packing it in, and because it's a trial, we've reduced the price. So hopefully you can join us. We'll be here along with our colleagues on 22 to 25 August. Now's the time to register if you want to try and join us for this first initial pioneering boot camp. Hope you're there. Cheers. Cheers.